Hey everybody, welcome to Buzz Ventures. Uh, it's me, your host, Zomboid, the fab uh, the ugly ass DM. Fabulous. <laughs> Fabulous. <laughs> they always sit there like, don't talk bad about my friend. <laughs> um, okay, so I was turned away and giggling because as soon as you introduce yourself, my I was tempted to just say, fuck off. <laughs> You know what, honey? Here's an open ta- invitation to always say fuck off when you want to. Cool. Uh, thanks. Uh, love. Tonight, yeah. tonight's very special. Chase is gone. Hooray! <laughs> what, Chase? No, I'm just kidding. We love- <laughs> no, we love Chase. We're sad that he's gone. Uh, poor guy is working, which is bullshit. We love you, Chase. We wish you were here. Uh, but that's opened up a new opportunity for us. Uh, not yet, not yet. Oh. Let me fucking. Oh my god. It. <laughs> uh, I'll just, I'll just hide. Let me, let me introduce our, our OG cast first on my, on my media left with my lovely wife dinner. Uh, yeah, we're going to skip one to actual rock star Zaley. Uh, <laughs> the guy, the guy who should be sitting on his fucking ass right now. Yeah, he's gotta get after it. Try to. So, he's here. He's, <laughs> see, he's yeah, gonna yeah. be a nightcap professional getter after. That's what I do. Uh, and then tonight we have special guest M. Uh, no, she is our like graphic it. designer <laughs> slash cast member. She's wonderful. Um, can and you she's, put a little sparkle on my eye when I do that? And, and yeah, in post. post. Sure. I'm just gonna yeah. edit that. All right, one. sure. Um, Learn how. <laughs> so. <laughs> it's bothering me, right? What am I doing? Show up. Stop being a tight member. The 45 minutes before I don't know what we were saying. Well, it looked fine. It looked fine until you were here in front of him. Let's show up the other stage and do the work. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, it, well uh, speaking of guests, uh, another stand in for us, Dylan, is, has been dead for 30 years. So. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where he's been, uh, but we have Nate now. Uh, you're goddamn right I did. We're prepared for that all night. Uh, Hellfire Nate is our producer for the night. He's the one watching the stream, making sure everything's Gucci. Also which... known as my worst half. Uh, Whoa! Hey. Whoa! 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 So, um, totally knew that. With that being said, uh, Brand Foodle has also elected to stay inside the cave to work on something very special. Oh my god. So you guys continue without Brand Foodle for now. Uh, but his, <laughs> his dad, the goose, is with you still. Okay. Okay, oh, so oh, that's how we get him back eventually. Yes, Hopefully. yes. Well, yes. So, um, basically what happens is, if you remember, um, you guys exited, you guys were about to exit the cave, just a, you know, a, a, a fucking doorway of light. You come out, and you're basically on a small slope that goes in down into a clearing in the mountain area, where there's a village, and a kind of like a little forest area, um, kind of flanking it. Does this village look familiar? Not at all. No. No, this is a completely new village. Uh, but the goose seems to hop. He goes, <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> oh. Welcome to Buzz Ventures. I'm not even. I'm not even drinking. Um, <laughs> I shouldn't announce that. Um, so yeah, <laughs> you guys see this uh, this tiny village? Like you can literally, from where you're standing, see every building that's there. Okay. Yep. So what do we do, friends? Uh, well, we ask the goose. Hey, goose. Punk. Punk. Okay. Punk. I know that uh, I know that your son's back there working on well, Lord knows what. But uh, I want to know. Do you know what that village is? <laughs> roll, roll an intelligence check. <laughs> <laughs> I'm learning. Things. Uh, sixteen and my modifier is two, so eighteen. That is exactly the DC I had in mind, actually. Woo-hoo! So um, you. Listen to the honk, and and in your 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 primitive brain is like, oh my god, I understand the fact what the goose said. Um, <laughs> You're finally understanding. <laughs> you can't. Like, like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> like, 
<laughs> and then you have that Charlie Day moment. <laughs> <laughs> Jam Toodle, um, Paddlefoot, tells you that this is the village of Norfolk. Uh, Jam Toodle, Paddlefoot, also owns a tavern in this village. What? Yep. Jam Toodle. Let's go. <laughs> so, do you guys make your way to the village? Brady, do you tell yes. us that there is a tavern? <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, so, I, I, uh, just so everybody know, after after I killed um, actual cannibal Shadow Buff, I gained. Uh, Don't kiss you. <laughs> <laughs> I know what I said. It's a your drink. <laughs> yes. With caltrops. Oh shit. <laughs> I mean, after we, uh, all, after we as a group valiantly slayed uh, the uh, actual cannibal, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I, I uh, gained the powers of uh, goose speak. So, uh, I understand that uh, our our little goose friend over there not only has that's a town down there that's called uh, that's uh, called Norfolk, Village Norfolk. Of Norfolk, and I was going to say Norwalk for some reason, um, Norfolk, and and he's got a tavern. Yeah, oh, we know what that means. I hire we know you went to Down from the mountain, the mountain. Tavern time? Yeah. Okay, so so you guys make your uh, way into the village. Everyone roll a perception check except for uh, Emma. Don't fucking touch your dice yet. <laughs> <laughs> Two, so nothing. Seven. <laughs> Thirteen. Um, Matt, you can't put your finger on it, um, but something is unusual in the village. Because you see people walking around. Some people have actually stopped to look at you guys. Like, oh, newcomer's cool. Like, they're not, like, alarmed by you. Um, but you start to pay a little bit more attention, and the village seems a little loud. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you know, huh? Are all the people geese? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Jam Toodle just comes up behind you. <laughs> My poor wife who's sensitive to loud noises. Sorry, honey. Oh, okay. <laughs> I prepared myself. Uh, no. Um, <laughs> so you, you guys, you guys know when like you go into a space and there's like more than fucking ten people and there's kind of that drone. Yes. Like mm-hmm. you can, like you can hear people talking. Like there's that kind of calm drone type thing. It's just a couple decibels louder than you would think it would be. Okay. Like there's, there's literally ten people in the like square, and it sounds like there's thirty people. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. It's a lot of bees. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, inside, so uh, Norfolk kind of looks like this. It's just kind of, it's got its little town square, um, and then it's got buildings surrounding the town square, and then behind that, like that square, there's some residential huts um, that you guys could go and visit, Uh, but otherwise, um, you immediately uh, notice the tavern on the far side of the square, because the sign is a goose. Of course it is. What? Yeah. That's my kind of place. Uh, I'm just going <laughs> to tell you right now, the tavern is called the Goose. <laughs> nice. Hey, uh, so this is why Grand Poodle was not surprised at all. No. To find that his father had been turned into a goose. Exactly. Which is funny because Chase didn't know any of this fucking shit. <laughs> but this is, this He's is like, yes, father. Making sense. <laughs> I'm sorry, I almost killed you. <laughs> So so, em, em looks confused because she hasn't watched our show. It's for the aesthetic of being a guest. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she yeah. wanted to keep it keep it. Uh, I know nothing. <laughs> so so basically, what happened is that um, these guys were all in a village, and they were promised what? Four, yeah, I know they were promised four hundred gold, and would, they were even given a house with a ghost, and it was awesome. It was Tom. going great. Tom, but then they Tom. went to go fight. Um, a band of naked bandits. <laughs> See all the shit that you fucking missed? <laughs> so, I'm part of a guild that owns Trolls Called Keep in Waterdeep. We got it by fighting things, and we own a keep. It's a tavern. 
we have a ghost bartender named Lyft. Nice. Uh, so so they have they have an, uh, a ghost who lives in the attic called Tom, the apathetic ghost. He just doesn't give a shit about anything really. Oh. He's very um, powerful. Mm-hmm. He's very, very powerful. Lyft's a great bartender. Oh, um, um, direct quote from Tom. Uh, fucking boop or whatever. I'm legit a really strong ghost. I just don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> um, so basically, what happened was they they left the village to go fight these naked bandits, mm. the homeless naked bandit brigade. Okay. And when they came back, the village had disappeared. Uh, while they were, I know maybe you should watch my wow. fucking show that I work hard on. Um, so anyways, yeah, yeah, uh, so they come back to the village and the village is completely gone. Like somebody literally picked up this village and moved it somewhere else. Uh, but in the middle of the village, uh, Bran Foodle spies a white shape and he decides to take the penis pump that he found in the cave. Again, watch my fucking show. Uh, <laughs> And he decides he's going to try to kill this white because shape. Because penis pump and yeah. heart pump. Yes. Which I'm yes. assuming is going to play it. Uh, but it turned out to be a goose, who was also uh, Bran Toodle's father, Jam Toodle. And now we are in his tavern. Or yes, walking towards yep, his tavern. you're walking towards his tavern. All right. um, you guys walk inside, and uh, again, there's a handful of people in there, but it's rel- it's relatively loud. I just push louder. Yeah, everyone um, make a perception check. Ah, fucking hell! E twenty-one. Oh, there we go. Nice. Um, Azalea, you immediately uh, bartender spot Ev's character. <laughs> um, <laughs> which <laughs> I, I normally normally when I start the show, I have everyone just reintroduce their characters, but we're gonna do that right now since we have a guest. This is the first time we've ever had a guest. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, so you, you, and your your team here, you guys all converge on this loud ass monk. Bartender, there! Uh, Aqua instantly goes behind the bar and goes up to <laughs> yes. the monk and and says, "You're not from here." <laughs> Says you. <laughs> okay. Sorry, that's your line. <laughs> Aqua's like, yeah, but, but like, what? What do you want to drink? <laughs> wait, wait. While this is happening, uh, Jam Toodle has popped up onto the tavern, uh, like the the bar, and is just <laughs> just walking, walking around. Is it some some the the actual bar this tender? Fucking bar is so fucking literal. <laughs> the, the, bar, the actual bartender behind the bar has greeted Jam Toodle. <laughs> oh, uh, hello, sir! Nice to see you again! People are going to be fucking weirded out. Of <laughs> I'm all for it. I hope someone calls the cops. That'd be the perfect e- exclamation point for Buzz Ventures. Someone <laughs> called the cops. We're just having a show. <laughs> Yeah. Yes. All your so try. This monk that you see, uh, she is uh, Mulan, if you will. She's an Asian <laughs> human. Jesus Christ. Literally the actual race of human in D D. Yup. It is a thing. Yup. I'm not trying to be that legitimate. You know, exists anyway. Monk. Uh, she's got know, half. kind of racist to me. Yeah, I wasn't say anything. But. She's got half a shaved head with the short, like bob, black wavy thing. Um, she's wearing this kimono and uh, just some really loose, kind of like black monk robes with flowers and shit. Uh, there's like three empties of fucking beer in front of her. So how um, gay is she? Hella. Okay. She's notorious for visiting a lot of the uh, <clears throat> bathhouses in Waterdeep, where she is from. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, yeah, it may have gotten her in trouble where she, you know, tried to get with her old adventuring party, but turned out to be a doppelganger that then shanked her. It was fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Uh, but uh, yeah, so she's. You don't imagine she would normally be this loud. Again, being very odd of a 
area. Cool. Oh, thanks, huh? But yeah, she's just kind of there. She's I'm like, gonna I'm gonna give you a little DM whisper. Uh, you are not cursed. Good to know. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, uh, my ears, so I legitimately didn't even hear what you said. Good. <laughs> 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 um, you know that there is one. You, okay. All of that has been in town long enough to know that there is one. Sure. Mm-hmm. She's just trying to talk to them. Shut the fuck up over there. <laughs> just kidding. Stop farting in my chair. That works. <laughs> uh, so, Olivet, would you like to introduce your char- like your would your character like to introduce herself to our cast, especially to Aqua, who's trying to take your order? Yeah. yeah. All right. Who, who am I? Who, who is this uh, person I'm looking at here? Uh, she, she um, <laughs> okay. <I> so, <laughs> so the person that's greeting right now is Aqua Bay. She is a half elf. Damn. Role play, honey. No, I'm telling her what I look like, and then I'll role play. This is bullshit. Don't talk about it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, I'm just um, kidding. Yeah, she's a she's a half elf <laughs> ranger. She pretty much looks like me. <laughs> okay, y'all. I, I'm okay, like fucking like legit. Like here, here's what I look like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so fucking good. At it. <laughs> Although I would like to take your order. I look like this. <laughs> <laughs> what would you look like? Great. Fucking bartender. <laughs> um, also, I forgot to mention that Olive is uh, tatted the fuck up. She's got oh, tats all the way tatted, down her but, spine, her arms, her. She's got one on her ass. If you get that look, <laughs> I need to know what that is. Anyway, <laughs> do, do, what, are, what are what are Nightcap and Mads doing? Yeah. Oh, well, I'm ignoring Watching. this whole scene. I'm looking for my loot, and I'm gonna go set up in the corner and try and. Oh, you have it on you. For the for the um yeah, I'm just looking in my pack for my loot, and I'm gonna go to a corner and strum. And okay. Try, well, try and gain some some coin. I love it. We'll do these two first. Uh, what is Nightcap doing? So he's just. Are you with Aquafe? Filling up to the bar? I'm just filling up to the bar. <laughs> I'm looking for some bourbon like last time. Uh, j- jam Toodle is, so, jam toodle is literally for you to drink. Yeah. Well, so if we got any Beaumont rum, that's the fucking shit. But I don't know if we export out this far. Hey, Jam Toodle, we got that? Um, all right, sweet. <laughs> and Aqua just rummages around the bar until she... Finds it. Ah, uh, roll, and... roll, 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 no. I love percentile. I, I don't think she has a. Uh, I don't find it. Uh, it's just the D10 and the percentile. What did you What did you roll? I rolled a two. I don't yeah. find it. No, you find it, but it's a oh. it's a knockoff. It's not Bomba, oh, okay. It's Brahmas. Okay. <laughs> well, I poured it to that. It's not as tasty. It's terrible. Oh, I slide it over. Be like. Yeah, so what else can I get you? <laughs> <laughs> and as she that like, I fucked up your order and, and don't really work here. <laughs> as soon as she looks away, she goes, uh huh. Chucks it. So kind. Mark was like, that'll be two gold cuts. Like, <laughs> what? Fucking <laughs> gold? <laughs> Um, well, honey, for you, I might just take you home for that much fucking gold. Hooray! Azalea, uh, roll, uh, roll a performance, please. <laughs> yes, that's exactly what I wanted. It's a four. I think I think a performance is an actual skill. So you oh, I did have four, yeah. so that's six. Dope. <laughs> Wait, four plus four does not equal six. No, no, I thought I had plus two, but ah. since I leveled up, it's not plus four. So, uh, so I you, got six. You you make thirty silver pieces. They can hear me. Mm-hmm. Oh, I was not anticipating that. Yeah. P- 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 uh, the, some of the bar patrons have quieted down as they're enraptured in your singing slash lute playing. Yes. What do you sing? Um, it's uh. Today is Tom Sawyer. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Exactly. Tom Sawyer. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Neil Pert's ghost is behind you, like. Oh. <laughs> oh. We'll have a moment of silence for you later. Yeah. But I'm going to yell to that'll, Aqua. That'll make you cry. Can you bring me a beer? You got it. 
<laughs> she, uh, uh, yeah, Naz is literally playing on her loot, and Aqua just sets, sets a beer next, like, by her foot. Yep. <laughs> um, so this, this all I goes on. I so for him another. Sweet. <laughs> So, so are you guys gonna keep keep talking to each other, or? So, um, I'm working. <laughs> so, <laughs> so all of it's all of it's gonna gonna kind of like shimmy up and kind of like you know show us some cleavage and just kind of like oh, ooh, gauge your interest here and that's hot. So, love <laughs> 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 it. Um, so, um, so what are y'all doing here? I'm so glad I get to edit this late. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Raise your hand if you've ever rolled a d20 for how good the sex is for your character. Uh, uh, yes, I do. I haven't right. yet. I haven't had the yes. opportunity. That's because you're yes. terrible. Wow, excuse you. This is a beautiful human being. She is a human being. I'm very interested. <laughs> but honey, who pursued who? Shannon, I'm working. No, I'm talking like you and me, dude. Oh, yes. <laughs> I'm really not going to this game right now. <laughs> you pursue me. Yeah. Sorry. You're not good. You're not a good pursuer. No. And that's okay. I'm not. That's right. <laughs> you see, I was the pursuer, so I know how. It works. Okay. okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> continue. Continue role playing, please. Fucking hell. Anyway. <laughs> Nightcast like I can't wait to shoot something. <laughs> Are you watching this encounter? I mean, yeah, I have nothing else to do, so thank you. Aqua is as visibly flustered as I am. Maybe <laughs> not. Hey, Goose. So, huh? Is it louder in here than you just made what, are, what, what are you guys here for? Um, uh, I mean, the Goose kind of brought us here, and I think he owns the place. Wait, and so you guys the, adventurers? Remember, the reason that you're here is because you're on the trail of Voss Wormwood, who made uh, Galifax disappear. I know you know that, but yes. I'm just yes. expositioning the shit out of you. That, I that is except in Aqua's mind, she's in a bar. And when she's in a bar, she serves drinks, and that is her entire. So then she slides over to this one because she's not interested, and she's just gonna put on the same amount of charm over here. So are you guys adventurers? Yeah, yeah. So are you guys adventurers? Who are you? What are, what do you look like, Mister? Or I mean, I don't presume to know anyone's gender. I don't really care. <laughs> Nice. There you go. Like, like, <laughs> like, 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 but like that like my preferred pronouns are gun and more gun. <laughs> my preferred pronouns are gun in two A. And uh I'm sorry, I'm so blinded by how beautiful you are that I honestly can't see your race without you telling me what the fuck race you are. <laughs> my race is really handsome. Oh, Yes, I'm putting that down. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Cat mean, yeah. That cap's race is ruggedly handsome. Yep. <laughs> that fucking tickles me, yep. bro. That's awesome. I do love it. And uh, the one upstage on there, up there, who, who's that? That's a. I'm just a girl. That's Mads. Madsen? Mads. She sings. She sings. She sings. It's pretty cool. Okay. That's cool. all. That's all you need to know. Catch the ear. That's all he said. So, like, also, none of you will answer my fucking question. Also, we can spare, right? Yes. Okay, I yeah. totally yeah, yeah, yeah. spare. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> are you fucking adventurers, and will you fucking help me save this goddamn forsaken village? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> 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 
I mean, the goose lives here. He didn't suggest it was in trouble. So, do you have fucking cotton balls in your ears? Can you not realize how fucking loud this village yeah, is? Hey, it's look, a look, look, I used to, I, 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 I come from a town where I come from where there was a dog just in there, so I don't really see having a problem with the goose being you know, our owner to be a little louder, I guess. Yeah, it's and our mayor is turning into a fucking beholder. I've been meeting other group. Thanks. Like, are you guys interested? I don't have gold, but like, fuck. Uh, well. But I you mean, fuck. Yes. <laughs> you want some fuck? fuck. <laughs> well, we are on the uh, we're, well, we're on the trail of a guy named Foss. So, um, I don't know what the fuck that is. Well, maybe our uh, little adventure coincides. Uh, when you say that, Jam Toodle flaps his wings heavily. Uh, so you're saying the adventure coincides? All right, I come back over at Jam Toodle's signal. So <laughs> my voice is a little sore. It's pretty loud in here, guys. <laughs> you know, it is kind of loud. Do you a drink, sweet thing? <laughs> Can I? I love this. This hey, is amazing. Hey, Goose. Mm-hmm. Well, so uh, what do you think these uh, uh, this whole beholder thing and this boss thing are related? Oh. Okay, that's pretty clear. That it's really- <laughs> Do you fucking speak, Goose? Yes. He did it until a couple hours ago. Yeah, yeah this is new. <laughs> what, Are you see, also cursed? No, see, uh, nah. See, Wait, who's cursed? See, what, the village. See, <laughs> what did I miss? <laughs> when, when a man plunges his combat knife deep into an actual cannibal, uh, it teaches you. <laughs> The only thing I need are these. Oh! What? Uh, but, like, also, there's, a, like, a problem with the village that would be really fucking nice to not have to yell. Are you saying you need our help? <laughs> Fuck! Hey, Aqua. Um, not the literally the best thing you could have said. This. <laughs> uh, yeah, literally the best. Can you get, can you get a burger for my new friend over here? That mine is legit. Sure. <laughs> I wore the same shit that I poured last time. I don't understand. M the player is why Jesus okay. pointed the answer. <laughs> All right. So two things. It sounds like the it sounds like the goose is in agreement that these. Uh, well, I'm fucking glad someone knows what the fuck is going on around here in this group. Well, yeah, it's the goose. goose. It's the goose. <laughs> Definitely. The goose is the smartest person. Hey, look, Buzz Ventures has gone off the rails again. <laughs> I think this is going just fine. I think so too. <laughs> All right. And I got to admit, my ears are starting to get a little. Yeah, I'm telling what? you, my voice got really sore. Yeah. yeah. How the fuck old are you? Everyone, make a Constitution check. Who's starting to feel a little bit like um, what do you call it? Uh, a bit of a sensory overload from being in the bar. It sounds about right. You, you, you feel like you. you <laughs> this have, is your home environment. Yes. You, yeah, you've you've probably yeah. been in the bar working for about half an hour now, but it feels like a full eight hour shift when you're done. Oh God. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Everyone's a little just just a little too loud. So so without so many words. Uh, basically, um, Olive's character is telling me. Oh yeah, that, my name's Olive. Yeah, Olivet. Olivet. I thought, Cordelia. I you didn't introduce yourself. No, I didn't. Oh fuck. <laughs> yeah, my name's Olivet Cordelia Gwendoline Beaumont. Uh, you can just call me Olive. All right, Olive. So what you got in store for us? Uh, what? All right, Olive. What do you think then? What are we gonna do? You can call me Olive, and that's all you're gonna call me. <laughs> or you can call me the night. Squire. <laughs> it kind of has a thing for thing for nicknames. <laughs> <It's all okay. laughs> or Liv. I can live with Liv. That's what you do there. So so Liv Liv tell the tell the cast what what the curse is. Uh all right. 
Get over here, you fucks. Um, so if you're gonna help me. literally not getting any closer. Nice. I did. <laughs> nice. <laughs> um, I am liking this one a lot. <laughs> and all of this. Get that olive. Uh, uh, <laughs> um, so, <laughs> this fucking village is cursed. I'm just traveling through it, but I'm in a fucking adventure and it's what I fucking do to save shit. Whatever. Um, I just like to get to my next fighting pit so I can win the championship, alright? Anyway, there's this fucking orb, appears every fucking midnight, and the town is just fucking cursed to speak really fucking loudly. The, the way I phrased it was that no one can speak quietly. No, yeah, no one can fucking talk normal. Like, I've noticed. I mean, I'm fine. You're all fine. And the mayor's a what? And, uh, yeah, the, the mayor is turning into a beholder. So that's not good. Um, do I know about the cold ghosts? No. Mm-hmm. Not yet. Um, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, anyway, uh, yeah. So that's all about I fucking know, but like I need to deal with this because my ears are about to bleed. All right. Yeah. So, so what is I, your next step? So, do I know? That? Check out the mayor. Just whatever you guys want to do. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go see the mayor. What, what, uh, what time is it right now? Like, I don't have a watch. Or the just sun like in game. Yeah. In game. Uh, <laughs> I would imagine it's probably getting close to dark. Okay. okay so yeah, it's nowhere near midnight though. Yeah. No. No. Not. Not even. Well. And have we taken a rest since? Oh, yeah, we did. Yeah. We totally took a lot yeah. of rest. Yeah. yeah. All right. So well, it sounds like we should go talk to this mayor first. I think and so. See what uh, what this mayor is beholding. Interesting. That Do you even you know what a fucking beholder is? <laughs> I legitimately don't. I, I may be able to hear. Hey, also. you. <laughs> The fucking rugby whatever. Well, you said he's turning into a goal. No, he is a he turn is he's he's he is he's a so. he, it, I do I've been drinking. <laughs> the beholder is he's not a the mayor. Is, okay. yes, the mayor is a beholder. I have also dealt with beholders in water deep, so like it happens. Do you know what a beholder is? No. Nope. Can I shoot it? No. I so I don't. um I out of game. Know. Think Mike Wazowski, but with like tentacles with more eyes. No feet. No feet. Okay. Fucking hovers. It's got eyes and fucking teeth. I've never. Oh, yeah, I have a picture. So like what? I was gonna say. I know you have a picture. Yeah, it's in my bag though. Xanathar's guy there. Yeah, Xanathar. That's the guy. That's yeah. who I had to deal You've with. You've seen it. Yeah. All right, so technical monster, got it. So, Mage but and I, a, a lot of, like, I mean, I psychic shit is what I understand, okay? Okay, I might have lied, I haven't actually dealt with him in particular yet, but I know there's psychic shit, okay, and not for your, for, you to hold. Hmm. for your swarm. He only has two eyes, that's not a beholder. Beholder has one eye. Yeah, just yeah, has one big old eye. But then the tentacles have eyes. Yeah, correct, correct. Yeah, they're balls. They stay in the end zone. Little tennis ball eyes at the end of them. In post, you could pop a photo if you wanted to. Yeah. Yeah. If you I wanted to. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That was a good, you know what? I'll give her that. That's good. I like that. Yeah. He's going to edit the back. I'll, I'll edit it. It's fine. Tell us uh, how to do the job. <laughs> Actually, this before we meet the mayor, this would be a good opportunity to start to take a little um, ten minute break. Yeah. So um, let's do that. We're gonna come back in about ten minutes. Every so everybody can pee specifically me. I have to pee like a racehorse. Uh, so that we can get refilled with our drinks. Do racehorses have to pee a lot? A lot. Yeah. Is yeah. that so, yeah. okay? Mm-hmm. So we'll see you guys in about ten minutes. Bye bye. Yeah. Towards focus. Instead of the other one. Okay. Don't know where you're going with that one, then. Alright, so our intrepid adventurers make their way to the mayor's office. Uh, Sure. What would you guys like to do? You're standing standing in front of a 
it, it looks like most every other, you know, residential hut in the village. So, all right, um, uh, what do you know about beholders' powers, abilities? Nothing. I may have fibbed a little that I've actually dealt with them before. You bitch. <laughs> Says the ominous. A finger just comes down and crushes Olive. <laughs> the goose is, you bitch! Yeah. <laughs> Do I know goose now? <laughs> Honk! <laughs> okay, great. So he knows nothing so about the beholders. Alright. Um, um, they fucking have eyes, and I think there's some like. Psychic bullshit they do? I don't really fucking know. Before we head in, can I give inspiration to somebody? Absolutely. Is that a is that a, is, is that a thing? I mean you can, yeah. Sing me a song. I'm going to inspire you. Since you look like a badass. Jesse <laughs> <laughs> Chichin. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> um so you guys are standing in front of this this D6. this hut. Yeah. What what do you do? So cute. I just in. fucking go in. Uh, okay. Well, so you walk into the mayor's <laughs> house. <laughs> it's just one room. There's, there's like a... As I walk in. <laughs> <There's>, <laughs> uh, and it, it, it's obviously a circle room. So like in, in one side of it, there's like a little cot, a bed. One side, there's a, um, a bookshelf. And in front of this bookshelf is a floating... Uh, kind of fleshy orb, big fleshy orb, and uh, it has four tentacles, each of which have a little eyeball at the end of it. Uh, the creature turns to you. Hello, Mr. Has, Mayor. Has one big eyeball and a, just a mouth full of razor sharp teeth. It says, "Hey, hey, what's going on?" Oh, yo, Mayor. Hey, what's up, man? Uh, what can I do for you? Found these adventures. Okay. We're gonna try and solve the curse of this uh, village oh, with man. all the talking shit and that's, stuff. That's really dope. Thanks, guys. I really appreciate that. Yeah. What? Do you know anything? I mean, can you be helpful? Uh, I mean, the only thing that I know is that you know, there's that orb that appears every you know midnight, um, and it appears exactly at midnight. So Has yeah. anyone tried to fight it? No. Where we're, we're does not it fighters. appear? In the town center. How long has this been happening? Uh, since I got turned into a creature. Which is when? Uh, maybe like a couple weeks ago. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it hasn't been very long. I mean, we, it's fine. Are, are you crying? It's fine. <laughs> probably, it's probably, probably been as long as since the... Oh, it's so sweet. <laughs> it, it's are you pro- coping? <laughs> it's, been, it's been a little bit... Less time than when Jam Toodle left the village to go find his son. So, um. So, shortly after Jam Toodle left, it started. Do you know who did this? Uh, I mean, he had. I mean, he's a guy, I guess. He. Is his name Did he have. I don't know. Did he have a a shield of uh, crimson dragon coming out of the shrubbery? I, into I the feel, like, into the shrubbery? I feel like, like you have a story to tell me later. Oh, that's just oh. that's just a bad thing. <laughs> the, mayor, the, mayor, the mayor's big bulbous <laughs> fucking body just Shut goes up. like this. <laughs> uh, yeah, man. I'll take that as a yes. Absolutely. Yeah, <laughs> okay, that's, that's okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, that, so the big bad has been. How'd you how'd you know? How'd you know that? How'd you know what I saw? What? Oh, we've been tracking this guy, Boss Wormwood. Oh man, I hope you yeah. take his fucking. He's a big old dick. I, oh shit, I love that. <laughs> is he? He's a fucking okay. asshole. Okay, but also, is he literally a dick? No, no. He might no. be. Sorry. As as far as this adventure is, Boss Wormwood is not. This is the beholder guy. <laughs> no, no. As far as this adventure is, I'm not going to make anybody a penis shape. I, I don't like... We do to, have a penis pump, though, so... See, that's the thing. That's, but, like, that me, could be the, the weapon to, to, to <laughs> that, take it that's down. That's the one weapon. There's <laughs> <laughs> only weakness. See, okay, oh, no. here's the thing. I, I don't think... I don't presume to know anything. I don't think penis-shaped things are funny. Like, I don't understand where, can, like... Can he then be a giant bulldog? 
No, I don't think genitalia shaped anything is funny. I think it's <laughs> dumb and cliche and dumb. <laughs> That's why I don't get bachelorette parties where they're like, oh my gosh, this stuff is shit that is jack. Like, fucking, so why is that funny? I don't, so I don't understand. <laughs> this is why I explicitly asked for none of I that. like sex, so, like, that's why I think it'd be great. But <laughs> yeah, it'd be great, but why is it funny? I don't find it humorous. Anyway. Anyway. <laughs> okay, we're not going to try to Next time that. on. Yeah. Oh, was that... Where you thought this conversation was going? You yeah. thought we were going to try and have sex with the... No, 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 no. But the whole is like, I've got four tennis. No, there is no beef. One for each of them. Somebody is doing the part. I don't know. By the way, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to de-level the next person who anyways me. This is my goddamn show. <laughs> Son of a... No, I'm just kidding. Keep totally on, fine. Keeping us on track. <laughs> You're all level two now. Damn it. Um... So the beholder's like, yeah. Um, I mean, other than that, um, I have noticed some like robed figures at the edge of in the forest on the edge of town, but like some what? Robed? Figures. How robed? Completely. <laughs> and did they have clothes underneath their robe? Uh, I've got five eyes, but I don't I couldn't really tell. All right, All right, right let's go me, there. No, yeah. Okay, what do you like are they like me, like monks? Or like, like what I mean, they kind carry, of, are, they, are they like shady? They carry of? the same sigil as like the one that you're the, talking about. The crimson dragon and the shrubbery. Yeah. <laughs> Again, probably the first. Shrubbery. The first, uh, <laughs> the first best one seems to be tracking these guys down. Yeah. Yeah. So, I agree. I agree. Okay, but like also, what about that orb though? Nah. No, we, we, we're gonna have to wait till Monday anyway. Let's go. So let's go, let's go see let's where we can find these guys first. Fuck. Maybe you, maybe you guys should listen to the monk. <laughs> what? I mean, what? You, can what? Do what, you can do whatever you want, but... Fine, we'll, we will... Speak up! Well, because obviously this is a mysterious orb. We don't know anything about it, and I kind of want to fight it. You want to fight an orb? Yeah, why not? She is drunk. Well, it's better than anything you're fucking in. That was not my idea. All I'm saying is it seems like... That's a cover-up, and I know it. No. <laughs> no. Nice. Right. Here, here's right. an idea. We go to the town square. We try... Stake it out. Exactly. Try stake it out. Does anyone know how to set up a trap? I'm not a rogue. Do I? Man, if you just have to set up a trap. God damn it. <laughs> Did we grab any of those bear traps? No. That would have been smart. That would have been smart. Did, don't we have a bag of holding? No. No. No, Brandon Fugle has it. You have a, <laughs> you have a mayor of the holding. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> oh, my fucking lord. That was amazing. Uh, yeah. I love that. Uh, yes. Yeah, I don't know how to make that. Uh, All right, so let's, let's I go mean, like, take I, outside. I, I, um, I know how to group beer, but I got a brewer's kit. So what do you guys do to pass the time? That's why I was saying go to the edge of town, go check stuff out, and come back. Because we have a few hours. You can be sneaky. We don't have to make our our appearance known. We can try and be sneaky and just see what they're up to. Right. Maybe not have the paladin gunslinger go be sneaky. Maybe have the bard with the higher decks, or maybe even the rogue with the danger. My (laughs) decks are easy. Your decks? Oh, that's right. Your fucking decks is out of this world. (laughs) My decks is also an eighteen. Whoa. (laughs) Sorry. My dicks is also an 18, too. I mean, I mean, uh, I mean, mine's a 17, so we got wow, you dicks nice. up a lot, too. Oh, very. <laughs> uh, don't, don't ask me to do anything strength based. So, what, what would you guys like to do? I mean, I mean, let's, let's. What's the actual time? Uh, you wow. surmise that it's probably like now, like a half hour before it gets dark. And maybe another three hours before midnight. Okay. So like eight thirty p.m. <laughs> <laughs> that is a joke from Galavant, and I love it so much. <laughs> when the crow <laughs> speaks three times at the <laughs> at so the about start, eight thirty. Like, so about eight thirty. Yeah, yeah. About <laughs> so what do you guys do? You I said camp. I'm with you. I'm gonna go sneak up on the on the rogue people. 
I want But I'm not gonna to stake out <laughs> the uh So are we splitting square. up the party? We're splitting no. up the party! No! No! <laughs> Never split the yeah, fucking we are party! Adventurers. We know this by now. Let's not do this. Okay, Jesus, so what someone, level are you? Someone, why? someone take take lead and tell <laughs> me what's happening. <sighs> yeah. Okay, right, well, at this point, it seems like lots and lots of the party want to go stake it out, and some of us want to go check out the real big. Is this a very big town? No, it's a very small. Like I said, it's a very if it's it's a very small town center. It's it's circle shaped, and then behind like this, it's it's kind of like a like an eye shape. So it's got you know the it's got the the fucking town square that's the middle. Mm-hmm. It's got like the yeah, yep, exactly, and then the the Surrounding buildings, and then behind it, the like yeah, yeah, the residential huts. So I'm thinking that we just go sneak up on these cultists and just see what they're doing, and then go back into where the orbs could be anyway. Okay. And we have three hours to kill. It's either sure. go, it's either go get drunk at the tavern. I like or, getting drunk at the tavern and sneaking out this thing. But then when we get there at midnight, we're all gonna be drunk. That's the problem. I'm already fucking drunk. It's too late. Yeah. Alright, so let's give some time for <laughs> all <the> sober up. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, do we think we can be sneaky? Not gonna lie though. I definitely have the way of the drunken master teachings. I know how to fight drunk. <laughs> oh, so are you better drunk? I feel like we're all better drunk. <laughs> Uh, tonight, I think that was just enough. Azalea is turning the same shade as her shirt. Yeah. <laughs> it's like I disappeared. <laughs> you know what? I think Nightcaps is going to go see out this hour. Okay, yeah, buddy. We leave uh, what's happening. Do you three go with Nightcap, yes. or is it a menage a trois? <laughs> no. Are we living Wait. in a. What? Well, we I was Katie hoping for that. So you yeah. four, <laughs> yeah. with Nightcap in the lead, you four. The uh, fucking man in the lead. Well, you the lead. I offered to go do it. All of seeing this will fucking book it to be in front of you because ain't no man showing her way around it. Jesus fucking Christ. All right. Uh, so <laughs> <laughs> You're so chill. You're like, sure. Whatever, <laughs> Whatever gets the job done. That's some shit. <laughs> uh, so the four of you um, <laughs> march your way into the forest. Quietly. As everyone quietly make, as we can. Yes. Everyone make a sneak roll. A steal. 14, my dex. Come on, Hey. Oh, so that's 18. Fuck me. Uh, no. It's 19. <laughs> what is yours? Me? Both of you. Both I'm 19. 14. 7. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you're, you're, you're a little too belligerent to be in the lead deck. You're making... Well, I'm in the lead. Much. I'm just not fucking quiet about it. <laughs> That's true. That's true. Um, <laughs> would anyone like to quiet the monk down? Hey, um, if you can just go ahead and not <laughs> Step on every twig that's in the forest, that'd be great. Can you roll your inspiration die and um and see if you can quiet her? Uh, yeah. I mean you only get it for ten minutes, right? So yeah. might as well use it. Twelve now. Yeah, you're fine. Okay, yeah, you're fine. <laughs> um so you guys you guys come across this very small clearing and there are six hooded figures. Um, five of them are surrounding one of them. Um, and as you guys are watching these six figures, um, you notice the ground beneath them start to grow or start to, um, basically from the ground rises this red glyph. And they, each of the five around this, the sixth one, uh, they all, um, uh, step to him and they fucking gut him with oh. a dagger. And they just start stabbing and stabbing and stabbing and stabbing before the sixth member's bloody pool on the ground. And the glyph that appeared above or from the ground starts to glow red. So, um, 
<laughs> you guys leave? Yeah, yeah okay, so we're right right away. Yes. Wait, that's, that's a good idea. You guys leave. You guys fuck off out of there. <laughs> what are you we doing? We got an alert from chat. Oh. Yeah, boy. Oh, who who oh. said it? That would be. Uh, that would be Chase. Oh, hi, Chase. Oh, hi, Chase. Hi. Aww. That's not Chase. Who is it? Oh, no, Chase messaged him this one. No. The one that's in chat right now is my dad. Oh, hey. oh hi, oh, dad. Hello, dad. Hello, dad. <laughs> Sorry, we've not met you. Hi, Papa. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> that's right, mate. <laughs> I told I you, Papa, I love you. I apparently have him. competition. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> Christ. Uh, so you guys leave. Yes, we do. Fuck? Now, so yeah, yeah, way, yeah, yeah. The, you're yeah. back in the loud I'm town. Gone. Yep, so you're back in the loud town. What do you guys do to pass the time? Because either you can go back and try and take out the cultists, or you can wait How's for the over to appear. How long did that take? Three hours. Uh, maybe half an hour. I gotta see if there's so... a way to set a trap. Yeah, so Is, are that's, there that's any enough time. tallish <laughs> building? Oh my god. <laughs> Hold on, that fine too. Um, so are there any tallish buildings? No, they're all about, anywhere? they're all about one story, okay. all the same height. Still fine. Yeah. Are there any of them that I can <coughs> get on top of? No. Yeah. Really I was not. just going to say, are there any rooftops we could access? Like, yeah. What are you with fucking rooftops? Um, they just roll, like roll perception. Back to all of us? Mm-hmm. Damn it. Seven. Six. <laughs> roll, roll a knowledge check instead. <laughs> no. Intelligence check. Thank you. Check. Thank you. <laughs> Sixteen. Sixteen. Mm-hmm. Uh, 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 uh. Mine's only a seven. It's still. What did you roll? A seven. The dice gods want me no, to have good. a seven. No, you're good. <laughs> Uh, Nightcap, Night you realize well, that because so each of the buildings right? are only uh, uh, one level, there's fucking four of you. One of you could just boost the other person up oh. onto a roof. Duh. Easily. Alright, not, uh, not me. I'm not fucking strong. No. I can monk my way up. I'm not strong. I was, <laughs> I'm not. I have a plus zero to strength. <laughs> oh, I have a plus three. But the reason why I want to get up is because <clears> I could at least like chill if they were with my bow. Right. And try to shoot some oh, shit. Yeah. You know how to you know how to finger a bell? Right. Right. Oh my yeah. goodness. <laughs> so, uh, I am not old enough for this game. <laughs> <laughs> how, how, many entrances, how many entrances to the town square are there? I mean everywhere. Like are you are you asking if there's like a path? I'm, I'm it's asking. a fucking orb. I don't know that it's gonna perceive anything. Okay, but yeah. So the reason I'm asking is because is there any choke points or anything that these cultists or any way these cultists nope. come from something like that? Nope. Okay. Pretty. Because open. like I said, it's it's it doesn't it doesn't even really have a path. Like right. it's it's clearing, forest, forest, and then like I said, all the all the main square buildings are all in a circle. Right. So and as far no, as we know, the cultists don't. Follow the orb into the square. Otherwise, as far as yeah, exactly. As far as you know, they've never even been in. Town, yeah, right. right. But so said them. they were on the outskirts. You've never seen them. No, right. But, they could be what is creating the orb, though. Right, and that and tactically, well, if it's to the, cover where whatever the from. fuck we just saw is anything to be a uh, fucking. I don't. Who the fuck is this Voss Moss bullshit dude that you're fighting? Like, mm. we literally don't know anything. He made our town disappear. Other than that. And so, we were we were told that we were gonna each get a hundred gold and this house with an apathetic ghost. We're just trying to find our home. We're, we are seeking our home. You are lost, boys. Got it. Yep. We are the last home. So. <laughs> Which direction yeah. did they, did they really come definitely from? Definitely a bar southeast west. Yeah. So, like, like, if you're looking at the town, <laughs> and then the, like, you got the compass is like the middle of the town. Yeah. It was like northwest. Yeah. So we should make sure that we come in the northwest, just in case for whatever reason those cultists come into town, 
and they're going to do something with the orb. I'm speedy as fuck. All right, well, <laughs> at least you should still pay attention to the norms. <laughs> okay. okay. So let's choose a house yeah. that is more on the northwest side of the circle and boost me up there. And I will safeguard watching to see if they come from that direction and choose awesome. to choose them if they do. And <laughs> also, since we have time before this fight, them. Um, I have prepared Enhance Ability, which is a second oh. level transmutation. Oh. oh, fuck. Yeah, so we can give somebody something. Mm-hmm. That I have Bear's Endurance, Bull's Strength, Cat's Grace, Eagle's Splendor, Fox's Cunning, or Owl's. How long does that last? It lasts um, up to an hour. Okay. So I don't want to cast it right now, but I want to see who would best be served by these abilities. I would say, you guys I mean, can figure yourselves. Yeah. I think so it'll be fine. You think it'll be fine? No, I think I will be fine without okay. it. Yeah. So I was thinking Bear's Endurance, where the target has advantage on constitution, constitution checks and gains 2d6 temporary hit points. Ooh. Give it to the tankiest character. Yeah. And our tank is no longer... With us exactly. today, so, so I'm probably the next tank person. Then. You think so? Yeah. What's All your right. HP and your AC? Thirty-one. My HP is thirty-one. <laughs> <laughs> you said your AC was thirty-one. Oh. <laughs> 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 yeah. <Right. laughs> when he said when he says that he's a tank, he's a literal tank. <laughs> I got it. So practically <laughs> handsome just yeah. meets your point. That, that 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 like, your that gender is tank. That cap's like, I got it from my dad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Yeah. Maybe yeah. He's a paladin gunslinger because he's a tank. Right. <laughs> the other thing I could maybe give you if, if this doesn't work out is um, Cat's Grace, in which what? you 14. gain advantage on um, dexterity checks, but you okay. also don't take clone damage. Oh, that one's been good. I am so confident. Oh, okay. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. So what do you think? What do you guys think? What do you people think? I think... Give it to Nightcap. You? Yeah. All right, so when the time comes... What's up? And I have have a feather, actually. So are we assuming that I get boosted up to the thing? No problem. Yes, so... (laughs) Olive will help. Never mind. But she... It's not graceful, and you probably get the feeling that she's just trying to fill you up as you are. Nice. Cool. cool. But in a polite manner, because she doesn't want to force you to do anything you don't want to do. Cool. Huh. Okay. I appreciate that. Hey, just a quick little... Just a, just a little... Let me let me help boost you up. Oh, okay, that's nice. <laughs> we'll do 20 to see how pleasurable it is. Oh my god! <laughs> 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 So, do you guys just kind of chill, sit there? All of will literally sit in the town square, cross-legged, like meditating, like just watching where the orb normally comes. Um, so, yes. as as night approaches and it becomes later and later and later, um, you hear some faint talking, loud talking, um, but eventually it just co- goes completely quiet, um, and in the middle of the town square, there seems to be like this black, um, like ooze that starts to pool out like this. It comes out. <laughs> and then from that pool rises this, uh, ethereal type orb and it just, and All right. it, it, it pulses and it sends like kind of like a shockwave. It's not a shockwave that would like knock you guys down or hurt you, but it's like a shockwave of this purple energy that's like that, and it, it it's and you you surmise that it encircles the the town, and then dissipates, and then a couple seconds later does it again. I hate this. All right, it's just sending a pulse. Uh, I'm using that's the it. To <laughs> that's the orb. Yeah. There it is. <laughs> Not big. The orb you described. It's there. <laughs> That's yeah. the one. <laughs> like, definitely a drunk person to say. <laughs> no, it's the other orb. Right now. <laughs> not the other one. Not, not the, the other one. one. That's yeah. the big brother orb. There's the little you orb there. Hit Sweet. <laughs> so what would you guys like to do? Uh, Can we investigate? Uh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. I'm going to go up and fucking punch it. No, okay. Let's not. Probably not do that. 
<laughs> but I mean, if you want to, do I um, one third of investigating. Uh, roll a strength check. <laughs> roll an investigation. Uh, not attack. Nope. Cool. Eight. Nope. You you um you hit the orb, but on its next pulse, it just harmlessly takes your hand and just boop. Hmm. It does nothing to the limb. That's that's lame. Right. Um, but you feel if you were a little bit stronger, you might do something. Uh, does anyone else want to take a fucking whack at this? I would like to do an investigation. Okay. <laughs> twenty. Not, not twenty. Damn. Okay. Woo! Uh, after seeing uh, Olive take a whack at it, um, and kind of just standing around the. Um, Coven. You fucking piece of shit. <laughs> Fuck you. No, I wish we could just pay uh, Yeah, exactly. So you, you hit the orb. Leave it to their imagination. And, and you're the one investigating it. So you start to realize that the the orb is what is causing the curse. So every night at midnight, mind? it comes up and basically resets the curse. Okay. Um. So... You guys are, are all keeping your mouth shut at the moment, but you realize that if you were to talk, you would sound like this, <laughs> just a little bit louder. Um, but with that being said, you do also realize that um, you feel like hitting it might actually be the correct thing to do. All right. All right. Well, I guess so. Uh, oh, Jesus. Fu- Jesus. Mm, oh, wow. Oh, I, uh. Wow, I'm just so much louder right now. I don't, <laughs> yeah, I don't even, you are. I think we just, you know what? Can I just? I think you had the right idea. Let's just break this thing. <laughs> All right. I'm going to try it again. I can't wait for you guys to break it. Oh, you're on a boost now. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take out. 17. 17. Um, so you... Are you all standing around it? You're on top. I'm on top. I stayed back. Yeah, I'm, I'm standing in front of it. And you are too. Right? The, 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 yeah, I'm, I'm, sure. I'm hitting oh, it. You're hitting it, Tom, of course. <laughs> so you hit the orb and it cracks. And the pulse kind of, like, it, it, the orb cracks. And, yeah, exactly. It kind of does like a little, uh, a little lull here. And, um,. <laughs> Uh, a second passes and it starts to crack even more and it cracks more and more and more. <laughs> and all of a sudden the orb pops and you two are both covered in blood. Uh, uh, you, blood. you start to feel like that you, yep, you start to feel like that uh, you're probably wearing cultist right now. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I was gonna say. Um, but as as the uh, orb is now gone, there's no pulses. You seem to think that if you were to speak, you'd speak normally. Uh, you two testing, roll perception, testing, right? Let's do that. Uh, no, just M and oh, okay. uh, roll what? Eighteen. Um, I mean, yeah, what's one? Roll what? Perception. Uh, nineteen. Twelve. <laughs> like you're the first, uh, Nightcap, you're the first character to realize that inside this little pool of gunk or whatever it is, there seems to be a, uh, a large axe. Mine. <laughs> <laughs> like, I mean, you have rooftop. I'm still, like, retching. That's why I didn't see it. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> you don't have to speak loud anymore. Are you still cursed? <laughs> <laughs> I'm covered in blood. It's not mine. <laughs> you basically popped a pimple. Oh. Yep. So sad. Oh. I know, right? Oh, but uh, those videos, I can't watch them. I have to. Kids. It's like a train wreck. Is that cat, what would yeah. you like to do? I'd like to pick up the axe and investigate it. Uh, you, you're gonna pick it up? You realize I mean, that you have to pick up that motherfucking axe with two hands. Sweet. Uh, you guesstimate it's probably 250 pounds. I'm pretty jacked though, so. Uh, I was gonna say, uh, out of, uh, what are, what is your strength and what is your strength? 
Azalea and uh, uh mine's at sixteen. Tian. <laughs> Tian. Mine's at twelve. <laughs> yeah, you you kind of realize that you're probably the only one of the group who could actually hold this and wield it. Huh. Uh it's a champion's axe. It does two D eight damage. Wow. Yeah. Oh yes, keep that. Uh so you you pick up the axe and you hear an ethereal really voice say well, that tickles. <laughs> the axe? The axe is cursed. You don't want it. <laughs> hey, what's what's going on, man? What's happening here? Did, is he the only no. one hearing this? Well, yeah. He, well, I mean, you would hear it too because you're oh. with, within range. Jesus, fuck! What? That uh, the axe stops everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, can't I, hear you. Speak up. Sorry, the axe talks. Why don't you come over here? All right, fine. Come on. <laughs> Uh, I, I mean, I was I was alive like uh, a couple hours ago, but <gasps> oh, you the, the, the cultist. But like, all, but my friends took me on a hunting trip, and now I'm just dead, I guess. What? Who are your friends? Yeah, who are your friends? The, are there five of them? My pals in the woods who work for Voss, man. Just, yeah, how did you get roped into working with Voss? I I don't I didn't I just they're my friends, so they took me out to the woods and. And now you're out. an axe. Drink some so, meat. do you mm-hmm. have any Drink any beliefs that we should know about? What's that? Do you have any beliefs that we should know about? No, uh, Muhammad. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, Muhammad. <laughs> wait, wait. But do you do you know who this boss is? I mean, I know he's my buddy's boss, but I don't know anything other than that. So, so were you trying to join? No. You were friends? Not what you. were you doing in the woods? He literally was just, what? from the sounds of it, looks like he was just trying to go on a hike with his buddies. Hunting your buddies and his are buddies slaughtered very him. naughty. <laughs> when did you so, meet no. your friends? You, uh, you know that your buddies aren't your buddies anymore, right? Oh no, what do you mean? I don't get it. They killed you. And break. now you're an axe. Yeah. <laughs> you're, you're an axe man now. I'm an axe man? <laughs> Are you guys going to be my new friends? Uh, yeah, that one yeah. will be for sure. Yeah. <laughs> He'll handle you real well. It remains to be seen. Well, let's uh, let's let's not uh, let's not get let's get, <laughs> let's not <laughs> get personal. Let's get carried away. Um, but, first, but you have to carry him. But he's an axe. But for now, but for now, we'd be a quick assist. Now, uh, yeah, where did you, where, where did your buddies hang out? Uh, well, in the woods. I mean, if, if you that's a really creepy wait, place to just wait. hang out. Where did they hang out when they are not in the woods? I don't know. Wait, first of all, what's your name? My name's Gary. Gary! Gary, Gary the Axe. Yep, yeah, Gary the Axe. Gary the Axe, what's your man. favorite drink? What? I said, Gary, what's your favorite drink? Uh, blood, I guess. I'm an axe now, so... Oh, okay, all right, all right. cool. All right. Wait, yeah. so, like, do you thirst for the blood of enemies? No, but I can't drink anything otherwise, so I don't know. What is this it's called? cooler to say if you search for the blood of your enemies. What is it? Can we I, give you a cool weapon name? Yeah, that's fine. I mean, I'm not attached to Gary. <laughs> Gary the character. <laughs> I mean, I don't, I don't have a gender, so I guess Gary could be my dead name. Ga- Gary, yeah. Gary the the gutter. Gutter. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Gary the gutter. Oh no. Okay, I guess that's fine. <laughs> Well, we'll, 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 we'll do a pretty we'll we'll workshop. I'm pretty lukewarm about gutter, but that's fine. Okay, <laughs> got it. I mean, I'm pretty lukewarm with all your blood. <laughs> <laughs> that's my blood. Oh no! <laughs> and don't worry about it. Sorry, Gary. All right, Gary. I'm right, more. Really, really sorry. All right, Gary. What do you know? Bag. What do you know about these orbs, Gary? Uh, I mean, the, the orb that was in the middle of town, I guess, was me. I don't know. Well, how are, you, you, are you from town? Wait. No. Well, it, what wait. town are you from? Where are you from? Well, I'm from Galifax. Of course he is. <gasps> Motherfucker. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, not you, Gary. I, you know what? As a, as a DM, I really enjoyed that, <laughs> that uh, fucking reaction you just had. That's nice. I like that. Oh. All right. you, you guys get the sense that Gary doesn't know much else. You literally, basically, literally what happened was his friends, in quotations, took him to the woods and murdered him so that they could continue cursing this village. Oh, yeah. Damn. I mean, these are some fucking hooligan hoodlum fucking... Uh, make, another, make another intelligence check. All of us? 
It doesn't matter. You all can. Nice. That's a minus one for me. Eleven. I'm not intelligent. Well, Fourteen. Well. Fourteen. Okay. So in your drunken stupor, <laughs> you start to realize that it's possible that that's how they were fueling the curse. So every new every orb at midnight was someone's life, someone's correct. death, someone's and what could I put it together that they would then come collect the orb, like crack it open, and like you don't know. no, okay. you don't know. I know, but I'm gonna tell you because well, I mean, I, I did roll the dice. You don't have to. So, uh, <laughs> do you think that they're doing this to make magical weapons or oh. to that I mean, because it, it why I mean. Yes, one, the town is cursed, and yes, they are killing people to keep the town cursed. But then why is Gary now an axe? Mm. Like, what is the purpose of that? So maybe we should go back to the forest, get some fucking cojones, and just I like the beat cojones. the shit out of them. I like the cojones. To figure yeah. out. Hey, hey, Gary, how did you become friends with these guys? Uh, I don't know. They just, I mean, they approached me in the tavern, and they what, said they wanted to be my butt. The Goose Tavern? No, the one in Galifax. Oh, shit. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, I want to fight something that's not going to turn into blood unless I'm actually tumbling them to the point where they're just turning into blood. Um, you think we can take them? Let's fucking do to- it. Let's do it. This town doesn't need to be fucking first. Um, as you guys are debating on what to do... <laughs> Cultists! <laughs> Alright. <laughs> they arrive in town! <laughs> yes. Did you see them? Question. Yeah, did I see them? Roll of perception. <laughs> yeah, you are. Look out. <laughs> With advantage because she's on a roof. I didn't, I didn't see them, guys. Wait, oh, advantage! 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 I'll, I'll, I'll give you advantage on that. I'll give you advantage on that. <laughs> yes! <laughs> the super serious D&D game. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, that is a <laughs> twenty-one. Nice. <laughs> so yeah, you 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 definitely see the cultists on their way. So you can tell your uh, cohorts. Exactly. I see. I I have a cat named Hank. I'm not a cat myself. What? What's going on, Aqua? Cultists. Oh. Right. <laughs> oh god. They come. Oh god. 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 Gary's the German axe. <laughs> please, oh, please okay. take some back to the mother Uh So the so four of the cultists come around and they they have they obviously they have their robes. They take off their hoods and they're just bald. It shoots them. Bald is a good look. Hold your fucking horses. No. <laughs> Hold your fucking horses. No. Um, I will not be stable. <laughs> Uh, the the it's fifth, a literal meaning. The fifth cultist removes his hood and he's just quite, got this Fabio yeah, hair. <laughs> quite quite comically, there is paint around like his mouth. Kind of like almost like a clown. Okay. But then from the bridge of the nose up to the forehead, there's a dragon. <laughs> Why? It's the dragon descending. Yes, it's a shrubbery. <laughs> I knew it's the only one like that. And he says, Hop there! Our orb is gone! You will die! And I attempt to shoot him. You, you, but here's the thing since, since you are all warned about it, you all get advantage on your uh, fucking. Initiative? Thank you, initiative. Aha! <laughs> Not a surprise. That's funny. Yeah. Shit, really? Oh my! Plus, plus, plus she rolled 11 on both of her. I rolled two 11s. Look what I did. 15 for initiative. Wait, look what I did. I rolled two fives. <gasps> and she rolled two, two fives. You were like so trying to get our attention that you were like fumbling to get your attention. You guys, you're coming. Wait, they're coming. Yeah, so my, wait, so Trav, my actual number is eight. 
<laughs> My initiative is 15. <laughs> I get plus four. This is like I the thing that takes the longest. You got the net 20. What did you get, Mance? I'm going to guess that's plus two. Do, do I get What's your dexterity? Yeah, sure. Oh, dex is one. So add your yeah. one to your bonus. Okay, cool. So then it's 20 as well. But no. Oh, shit. Sure. Dirty okay. 20. Yeah. Dirty. I need to pee. I need to Oh, that sucks because it's initiative time. It's usually taking a five minute. <laughs> yeah, let's do, let's, you know what? Let's do that. Let's take a five minute. Hey, okay, give me a chance to write my fucking order here. Uh, and, and we'll be back. It's it's not going to take that much longer. I we'll just take, need we'll to take, we'll take, yeah. Yeah. I do too, to be honest with you. So that's fine. Take a five minute break. We'll be right back for Buzz Batch. They're, they're literally cultist leader. Bam, bam, two cultists. They're within 30 feet of you. All right, Gary, ready to get bloody? And there's a. Oh yeah, I'm ready. Okay, so you pull, hoist the gear up and takes a, takes a swing right at the cultist uh, leader's head. Okay. Ooh. Roll for attack. Ooh. That's a nine plus. You're not gonna hit him. Fish, well, because he four. has inspiration. Be quiet. Oh, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Four plus four plus what's was it would be strength or dex? Uh, <laughs> it could strength. Yeah, so it's Perfect. plus four. Yeah. So eight. That's seventeen. Actually, that is a hit then. Oh man. Yes. I <laughs> I'm just really happy that this alien didn't tell me to shut the fuck up. <laughs> be quiet. In not so many In a very ways. nice way. In a very nice way. In a way that I don't want my DM to kill me. <laughs> Uh, roll for damage. Yeah, so D8. Tell you that time time. Yeah, yeah, D8. You need D8. So I'm going, we all need to tell you that time time. Yeah. Time one. It's true. <laughs> oh, I should have been getting my insult trait. Bugger. So a six and a seven. A six and a seven, so that's a thirteen. Thirteen? Plus your strength modifier? Yeah. My strength modifier is four. So, so that should be seventeen, 17. points of damage? Correct. I mean, he's doing okay. Got a yeah, he kind of. He, you you swung at him, and he kind of just leaned back a little bit, and just cut like, like part of his clavicle and then like his cheek. Wow, he's hurt. Seventeen. Yeah. Kind of hope so. He's got a lot of health. Uh, it is master. <laughs> All right, I direct this at the leader, I guess. Okay. Since that's what we're going after. Someone with your qualifications should go far and never come back. Bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> so, I don't remember what... This is vicious, vicious mockery. So it's a d4. But you have to do a saving throw. That's true. Two. Oh, uh, what is that, wisdom? I don't know. Wisdom saving throw? Oh no. Uh, he takes no damage. Fuck. Roll a nat 20. Fuck you. <laughs> oh man. I think my favorite thing is Azalea swearing at me. There's just something so special about it. <laughs> Nick's dying over there. Oh <laughs> uh, well, that was my. Um, that was your turn? So that was my turn. Yep. yep. Uh, it is Olive's turn. Oh, wait, get him on it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to inspire somebody. Oh, yeah, go for it. Yeah, absolutely. So, Olive, <laughs> you look phenomenal tonight. Do the thing, kick some ass. <laughs> I know you're coming on. Okay. So, literally, the bard of the group was just like, Hey, you piece of shit! But you look really good. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Yeah, love yeah, that. yeah. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. yeah. It's, it's like, it's like Rivet City Productions in real life. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> anybody, anybody, right? anybody. Yeah, exactly. I don't get this many compliments ever. Jeez. Why not? <laughs> Emma, yeah, why not? Em's like, I'm going to be a guest all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I love coming to Rivet Snake stuff because you guys just love me. Oh, oh that's true. We do love you. It's true. <laughs> um, all right, so I am going to try and do a perfect plank with uh, this guy here. So I'm going to fucking. <laughs> And run around uh, to the back side, so uh, advantage. Oh, I fucking love that. Yes. Get <laughs> yeah. yeah. Wait, okay. wait. Advantage. Yeah. Give me the yeah. right one. Okay. Um, and I'm gonna pop, pop. Uh, and pop, pop. I'm gonna actually spend a key point 
because I'm a fucking monk, bitch, and I'm going to have three attacks. Oh, fuck. Um, Damn. So I'm going to pull out my quarter staff. The first attack, natural 20. Oh, Jesus oh. Christ. <laughs> I'm pretty sure my cultus leader's dead. <laughs> God, I hope um, so. I should have so made this harder. Fuck. <laughs> Four... You didn't know you were going to have a nine, special badass. That's true. 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 points of damage on the first one. Damn! On the, oh, on the first attack. On the first attack. Oh, Christ. Um, yeah. Does Bardic Inspiration work for damage or attack rolls only? Attack roll. Attack roll. Okay. Oh, It was another natural 20. <laughs> no, no fucking way. way. You know what? I witnessed that. I'm going to do this for you. Master. I'm going to do this for you. Which die are you using? Your metal. Your, yeah, the metal one. All right, love that die. You know what? Actually, I need to see the damage on this. All right. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you obliterated him, but I need to see the damage on this. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven 10, 11 points of damage. Oh, that's actually not as bad as it. Oh, that's right. That's her second but that's the second attack. attack. Yes. Holy so shit. Three total right now. Four. And the third attack. Oh, that's a four. Oh, not too good. So we're nope. going to roll that inspiration. All right, so that's... Four. Oh, that's a two. Fifteen to hit. Oh, my fucking God. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> okay. Points of damage. Can I, can I, can I explain what happened? So, this drunk ass monk <laughs> comes up to a intimidating cult leader. She punches him once, and he, he, he kind of like, ooh, punches him a second time. He folds in half, basically. And the third punch, he just. <laughs> Like, no joke, the motherfucker is just <laughs> and so you a see, red cloud. So you see her kind of got this, like, drunken fucking swagger to her, right? And she's fucking hitting, and you're like, that's not a hit. She's just fuck that hit, right? Um, And part of my uh, drunken technique when I use Flurry of Blows, I get to uh, disengage and okay. add an additional 10 feet, so I'm a fucking yeet myself out of that situation. <laughs> That's perfect because as you start to back up, you feel you you feel a whoosh of wind behind you. And you you three uh, recognize boss. No, recognize that Anne's character all of it is now gone. <gasps> she has been portaled away. Yeah. What by boss? Sorry, dude. No, it's by the other four <laughs> cultists. Oh, okay. Yep, so you guys you guys start getting ready to fucking go for these other cultists. And they both, they all of them, like, push oh, their I hands am. towards you. And you three are now portaled away as well. What? What? Yeah. <gasps> Where's Jam Toodle? Shit. At the bar where we left him? <laughs> <laughs> but, 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 remember, the, he's probably cured of the curse now. Yeah. You would think. You would hope. Yeah. Hope so. So where are we? Still. That's it. Where is That's it? the end. Find oh, out next time. Find out Buzz next time on Buzz Magic. <laughs> That's why I was a little hesitant to take that last break, but I had we had P. Yeah. Yep. You got it. You got no, it. No, that, that was perfect. Good timing. So Should we um, do a table talk? Yeah, we can do a little table talk. Um, that means whoever is running the stream has to pay attention to the chat in case anybody Instead has any questions. Instead of being on his phone. Nate. <laughs> you were so much like Anna in that respect. Dude, I took a nap well. I'm kind of out of it right I'm now. So, but I'm, I'm a lot nicer to Anna because I'll be talking I'll be talking to my wife and then I'll be like, you, you, didn't, you, didn't, you didn't hear a word I said, did you? She's like, no. What's up? You bet, no. Again, I just yeah. I'm out of it right now. So we're Jesus, doing the, 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 this episode is over. We're doing table talk now. <laughs> so you have to pay attention to the chat in case there are any questions for me or my cast. <laughs> or the cast. Were you confused by anything? No. Jim, not you. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously Nathan, you were confused by the You were paying attention. Well, maybe you weren't either. Sorry, we're off topic. <laughs> Let's table it. Yeah.
<laughs> the table talk it. <laughs> so next week we uh, we will have a full cast. Um, I did re- I forgot that Azalea will be gone on the thirtieth, not next week. So Which is my birthday. That's You're right. It'll be my birthday. It'll be it's going to be on my birthday. <laughs> I like to have her <laughs> <laughs> so uh, next next week we also have another guest, um, which is super special. Um, it's not unfortunately it's not going to be him. Um, but but it's Lee. No, no, it's no. not you. <laughs> it's me. Maybe the thirtieth, but not you. Um, but you know, uh, honestly, I, I I would I would definitely want you back as a as a. I didn't get to fucking fall down with anyone. Oh, well, you got portaled away. Yeah. Shit. You, come on, motherfucker. You exploded a guy and then got spirited away. Uh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the other cultists were like, oh shit. Woo-hoo. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Doctor Strange this bitch out of here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Um, but yeah, no, so, um... No, I'm definitely coming back, though. I gotta go down with one of these ladies. <laughs> I... I wanted the bear to be a beholder. Just because I thought it would be funny to have a beholder who's just like, Hey, what's up? Yeah, that was yeah, that really, was really funny. I was not anticipating <laughs> that at all. No. Um... If well, you, especially because you were trying to get us to not go to the mayor at first, and I was like, <laughs> <laughs> "Something okay. bad is going to Yeah, are we going to have combat here with the ball? Yeah, yeah. Um, that's like that too. If you were to press the mayor a little bit more, uh, you would have discovered that um, the curse was just a glamour. So he has he has the normal stats a human would that doesn't doesn't adventure at all and has zero combat experience. Okay. He has the only ability of a beholder that he has is that he can float because his he doesn't have fucking feet. Yeah. So that's sure. it. Okay. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> He's only so a little bit. Does he float right. because he walks and the rest is just invisible? No. Like he's actually. Oh, no, it just oh, completes that would, the That's so funny. Yeah. yeah. So it was really just a cosmetic curse. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> so what it. was the curse on the, the town? Was it. Nobody was it? nobody can speak quietly. But why? That was the curse? That's, it. That's it. Yeah, why? Is that uh, just to fuck with them? Can you imagine if someone were talking at a really big volume all the time? God. Oh, no, there's an SNL skit with that. Tra- with Will Tra- Tra- Travis, why do you have to talk to yourself? Why do you have to talk about yourself like that? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, this hurt. <laughs> Don't listen to him. <laughs> we love you, Travis. Call me fucking idiot. Mother of us! Who are you? <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> Get away. What, baby? Get out of us. I don't know what we're talking about. <laughs> it's another SNL skit. <laughs> <laughs> Who's in it? So, uh, Keenan Thompson. I don't know. Um, no, 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 no. <laughs> was it Bill Forte? No. No, it was not Matt, Matt, that It's one. Matt Forte. <laughs> yeah, uh, do you guys have any questions for me? Uh, so many. Do you, so next week, we are going to have a full house. Yes, we are going to have a full house. Are you going five. to explain then where we are portaled the way to? Correct. Okay. Yes. And then uh, that will and obviously that'll be the perfect way to introduce our fifth fifth member for next week, um, <coughs> which is super exciting. It's so exciting. Yeah. I am I am so happy to have her. Uh, so who is going to be our guest next week? Shall be a surprise. Oh, okay. Yeah. Shall be a surprise. Proud now. What? He said a proud now. It's a she. I mean, Indeed. we well, actually, don't. No, I no, say, she, I, I no, never she asked did what, say she. I asked. She did, yeah, she did say. Yeah, that's right. You did ask. Very yeah. good. Very good. This about to be like, oh, no. Yeah. I didn't ask her what. <laughs> and we're off the air. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, so, yeah, uh, I have another really funny episode for next week, which is, I hope, every fucking episode, because that's the point of this. I'm so glad episode. I'm not going to miss next week. Yeah. I'm just yeah. so glad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, the guest, like I said, the guest that we have is pretty special, but um, thank you, Em. For, Yay, thank yeah. You. Uh, I'll be perfectly candid. We, we actually didn't. Um, intend on having Emma as a guest, 
but it turns out she was a fantastic I was, guest. Yeah, yeah, I was going to be a, the, the tech gremlin, and then, yeah, and then exactly. that one showed up. I'm really yeah. glad that you were yeah. not a tech gremlin today. Me too. No, seriously. you. I think you made this episode, and uh, yeah, we're I, really grateful I, that I, you I don't want to take the show. Because you guys shine so brightly. Oh, thank you. A show that you've never seen before that means so much. <laughs> How do you know that? Actually, I have seen every episode. Yeah, I've been mine episode. this whole time. <laughs> you introduce yourselves. Come on, get it right. Well, if you haven't seen our other episodes before and you would like to see the ones leading up to this, then you can check out Rivet City Productions on YouTube. Okay. And you can also follow us, become a patron on our Patreon. That's patreon.com slash Rivet City Productions. Um, anyone that becomes a patron on there, it's as low as a dollar per month to support us and to support what we do here at Rivet City. Um, you will get exclusive content for being a patron. And we have a couple of patrons that we would like to thank. Oh, my, my wife needs <laughs> my mind. Uh, so uh, we would like to thank our patrons, uh, uh, Heather Thomas, Yay, Jim Heather. Sanders, Teresa Can't wait to see you again. Uh, I was going to say, the, the, the cool thing about Heather is that she she is uh, unlocked a tier yep. of the patron where she actually has been an NPC uh, in the game so far. So um, you'll have to look out for her character again. Um, otherwise, um, stay tuned. We're going to we're gonna keep doing the show. It's going to keep being really fun. Um, like my beautiful bride said, check out Ribbon City Productions on YouTube. Uh, we have a Twitter. We have an Instagram account. Um, Facebook. Yep, all go to Facebook. Things. Do Patreon, all that bullshit. Um, we have uh, No. We have a couple new episodes of <laughs> Neighborhood Gaming coming out soon. Um, we also have, uh, we're moving Zomboy and Dinner to Wednesday nights at 9. And then very soon I'm going to be starting my own solo stream. Can't wait for it. So if you want to see more of that gorgeous mustache. Fuck that. That's stupid. <laughs> uh, the, the show, <laughs> I'm, I'm titling the show Zomboy Doing, which is, which is my tag on uh, Twitch, so um, it'll probably be during the day, Monday or Tuesday, where I just am a sleepy boy and I come in, I play games for a little bit, and you guys watch, and I talk to you. Yeah. So yeah, uh, we're all gonna fuck off now. See you guys later. Next time on Buzz Ventures. Yay! Yay!